Hey guys, welcome back to Keegan's Kitchen. And today I'll be showing you how to make the best jerk chicken in the oven. It's gonna be juicy and packed with a ton of flavor. You don't wanna miss this one guys, stay tuned. Okay guys, so I'm just gonna poke some holes. This way, the seasoning will be able to soak more evenly through the chicken. I'm just gonna add some uh, paprika. A little bit of cayenne pepper. Give it an extra kick, extra spice chicken seasoning some all-purpose a little bit of jerk dry rub jerk dry seasoning after we mix in our seasoning then I'll be adding some uh, jerk seasoning too much and the jerk seasoning can be purchased at like any Walmart your local Walmart or public supermarket you also want to marinate your chicken for at least two hours or overnight for best results okay guys this recipe is super easy to make um, you just want to put your oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit and bake it for one hour. Okay, so I'll be baking my uh, chicken on a sheet pan. Okay guys, so after baking our chicken for 30 minutes, this is what it looks like, all right? I'm just gonna pour all of that juice off into a separate uh, bowl, a small mixing bowl. After we pour it off, we're just gonna flip our chicken over and then place it back inside the oven for another 30 minutes. And then we'll start working on making our jerk sauce, all right? about a tablespoon of jerk sauce. Mix it in real quick. I'm also gonna add some barbecue sauce to add some sweetness you know, to our sauce. Mix it up some more. Also going to bring this sauce to a boil. Once it comes to a boil, we're just going to turn the stove off, and that's going to be it for the sauce. Okay, guys. So my chicken have been baking for about uh, a good 45 minutes. At this point, you want to remove it from the oven. Grab a little brush and just nicely, you know, baste your chicken with the jerk sauce on both sides. You know, you're gonna flip it over after you brush the first side. And then we're gonna place it back in the oven one final time for about five to 10 minutes. And this time we're gonna turn the oven on broil, okay? This is gonna add that extra char, that dark, you know, burnt look you know once we put it on broil for about five to ten minutes 
it's gonna add that charcoal grill, you know, resemblance. It's gonna be looking just like you would do it on the grill. bunch of flavor. Like I said, this is a super easy recipe to make. Um, you can't go wrong, just follow the instructions and you should be good to go. I'm just gonna add some jerk sauce just to top it off. Thank you guys so much for watching. Mm -mm. Woo. all right guys don't forget to like leave a comment share my video and subscribe to my channel for more amazing recipes thank you so much for watching